Alright, I figured it out. That's actually a uh, regular... That's actually a regular um, thing that we have to... A regular way up we need to go do. So... Let's go handle these now, the last five. Ugh. Love this dungeon, it's just very confusing. So do I have light arrows? I do not. Light arrows. I should probably text Lemus soon, tell him that, uh, gonna be a little late, Stone Temple. I have to do this puzzle again. Lame. Only problem is, is that you do kind of have to do this temple in three in like three shots. It's kind of annoying, but it's it's okay. I, I, I can put up with it for the sake of this. Just equip those two now. Here being the next room. Yeah, this one, I don't know why, I don't know how I missed this one. Just me being thick, I guess. I don't really know what other, uh, what other excuse on this guy. Yep, that was it. Just me being thick. Okay, now we go back around the rest of the way. We can get the other ones. Right here.
Can I get out of here? Because I don't really need to be on this side. Okay, I can't. I have to go back out. The other way. Let's see. Um, okay, it's through the okay, it's, it's through the maze. Okay. do this if they blow up one of the, if they blow up one of the boxes. You just have to substitute in one of those creepy things. Ow. That was foolish of me. Okay, I hit the right button there. Like the game. Almost done. Almost done. I, I, I feel like I'm... I, I feel like I should keep reminding so people don't get too upset with me wasting time. Almost done. Now we're in here... And I think I just need some light arrows to get through. Oh, that's that's how I do it. I I remember. Need to use another one of need to use another arrow type. She just stop lasering. That's really annoying. Now I'm out of magic power. Damn it. <laughs> Okay, that's where the other one is. It is behind him. I just have to do something else first. Let's get my bombs back. Alright. Let's see. Can I get out of here without having to... 
warp back into the room? Probably not, huh? Alright, throw me again. Squirt back out, come back in, do it again. Great fun. Don't worry, everyone, this dungeon is just this annoying. Well, the backtracking part is boring. The rest of the dungeon's pretty fun, but... Yeah. Son of a bitch. Stupid bomb shoes. Not to take it. An extra step, extra couple steps. <laughs> Sorry about that. So you're getting tired of the eulogy of emptiness yet? <laughs> I know I am. Alright. Yep, yep, what's this one? I just have to kill him again. Awesome. Now we can just warp out of here. Then flip the temple again and come back in to go fight the boss. Last time playing it, promise. Okay, I gotta shoot this thing. And there is other stuff to do that, that I could do after this, but I'm debating if I want to or not, because I can put it on, on, a, on a collection video, like at the end, and have it be just fine. Because I, I don't want to have to make you guys sit through this again. <laughs> sit through more after all this nonsense. Okay, where am I even going? It's a damn good question. Let's see. I think I am to head up here. I 
think at least. Yep, I have to make it through this room. Upside down. Which was easy, actually. Alright. Now, I actually should have done a little more prep for this, for this boss, so I'm going to use this method. But, screw it, we can handle it. Oh, awesome. Giant up uh, two giant snaky things. Put on the giant's mask. It's a giant monster fight. Obviously, you can only hit its uh, tail and its head. Yeah, I was gonna say I could swear these things had magic. Normally, to fight these guys, you just have to be uh, sh just shooting them with arrows. fun. See, the giant's mask is fun in that fight. It it speeds it up a little bit. But you can just use arrows. It just takes longer. Well, for now, all we can do...
skull kid? Maybe. maybe. So do we just purify this place? Huh. Well, that's cool. Alright, and now we have the four remains. Meaning we can go play the Oath to Order and go fight, and go fight Skull Kid. That'll be a different day, though. And allow me to cut one more time to where I can make sure I know where the fairy fountain is. Because I don't want to have gotten all these things and then have to have, have to have them go to waste. So, I will be right back. Alright, it's, actu it's actually pretty easy to find. Right here. I thought it was going to be more complicated than that. But we have all the fairies. So... Take a nice deep exhale, because we have all the fairy rewards. We're awesome like that. Wait, you're new. Yeah, there's only three great fairies in Ocarina of Time. This is the this is a fourth one. The fairy sword. Awesome. Oh, it's a C button item. That's substantially less useful. Yep, we now have the have the great fairy sword. It's not really that good. Kind of a letdown after having to do all that, isn't it? It's a two-handed sword. It's not bad. It's not that bad. It's just you can't block when you have it. So regular sword is better by leaps and bounds. So that's it for that's it for this week. Sorry about all the starting and stopping. I had to keep checking on what to do and where to go and what not. So I'm going to go deposit my money, and that will be the end of this week's upload. Again, sorry for not doing it last week, I just felt like crap. And I still don't feel 100%, but, well, I felt good enough to record. So, um, yeah, so I will see you guys next time with more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask with collection videos until we... <laughs> Couldn't have ended without one without one last coughing fit. So, we'll see you next time with uh, with collection videos until we have everything that we need. And by everything we need, I mean everything. So, I'll see you guys next time with more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Rain K, out. <laughs>